another edition of Five Fast Facts on a Friday with. <laughs> I don't like babies! <laughs> Will you watch my Aqualand? <laughs> Formula One car? <laughs> was it Formula One? Would that be more of a. I don't know, I was listening. That was more of a. Ooh. It's Five Fast Facts on a Friday with me. Babies! <laughs> What's me? The fucking retard of my boss. <laughs> Daniel from the Beanies. Daniel from the Retard <laughs> Anonymous <laughs> Visual Circle Visual Guys! Uh, Me and Chris Am I not a guy? Not you're a girl! Mm. And this week we're all talking about oh guess who we're talking about this week I thought it fits in perfectly Chris it's beautiful this one <laughs> I don't know um, what we're talking about Welcome it? back uh, make an appearance on FFS um, <laughs> it's been a while for you. Um, this week we're all talking about. Boom! Get off! Falcon and Winter Soldier. Way, <laughs> just the Falcon now. I thought we'd we'll give us some cool facts on the Falcon. Well, it's Falcon and the Winter Soldier. I know, Chris. This last week. <laughs> in fact, be in fact, you haven't even seen them yet. I haven't shown them before. Funko Pop shit. We'll get to that in a sec. Yeah, we're going to talk about Falcon uh, on a Friday. <clears throat> that was sickly as fuck. On a Friday, on a Saturday. On a Saturday. Rick it on. You just got Rick out. Babies! Uh, so here's it. Before I've lost my flow, it's Friday. I'm Daniel. That's Chris. That's a fucking cave troll. <laughs> I had ice cream for breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> I had ice cream for breakfast. It's like that kid in the back of the class. You know, there's the fucking little, the little wido that needs a little bit of help. It's like her. Uh, who can do the math quiz? What's nine times eight? I have ice cream for that thing. Seven, eight, two. Oh, is that the answer? Yeah. Well, there's time to kill the back of the class. <laughs> <laughs> it's Falcon on a Friday. Play my fast. These have got some really interesting ones which you'll enjoy. Why are the lions going? Because it's the Falcon. But why are the lions going? Because it's interesting. But why are the lions going? Because it's interesting facts about a character on a show that you like. <laughs> <laughs> First fact to Rooney. Yeah, Chris is confused Eight Mile with Green Mile, one about a rapper and one about a miss accused, whatever the word is, yeah. man who gets sentenced to death for a crime he didn't commit. It still happens to this day. What are you confusing Eight Mile with Green Mile? Tom Hanks says palms were sweaty. <laughs> anyway, first fact to Rooney. Sam Wilson's real name is actually Clarence. The reason why I brought that up is in 8 Mile. I want to say his name, Anthony Mackie's character name in 8 Mile was Clarence. I'm pretty sure it was. But anyway, so his real name is actually Clarence and he is from Harlem. And he had a, he changed his name, he had a pure horrible backstory. They don't show you in the, in the, 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 the show as much. Well, I didn't show you at all. But his, his dad was murdered, his mum was murdered by a mugger. He'd become an orphan. Uh, in Harlem, and he started to be a bit go on the, the darker side of 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 of, of the, the law. Yeah, uh, but Clarence is he from Eight Mile? It is Clarence, isn't it? I thought it because it's like you know Clarence, and he says that line. I fucking knew it. Uh, that's your first one. <laughs> right, yeah. Good, spin off the first fact. Um, under the name Snap, he went for the name Snap, the nickname Snap. He would actually go on to work for the Mafia after leaving Harlem and New York City and stuff. Uh, which is quite interesting because I would love the fact that if they could do some sort of show where they show his roots, he goes back to Harlem and who's there? Batman. Batman. <laughs> Luke Cage. <laughs> right, yes. This one's pretty cool. Who's the arch nemesis of Captain America? Me. Better not be bitch. We stand for justice in this house. Who's the arch nemesis of Captain America? The red, the red skull, the red fucking skull. <laughs> Honestly, do you... <sighs> right. There, anyway, the red skull actually recruited Sam when he was at the end of like his sort of mafia weird ass days, and he was the one that gave him his ability to have enhanced strength, and he was uh, gonna replace Sam. Uh, Bucky with Sam and have him as a sleeper agent on Captain America's side so he'll be as Captain America and the Falcon but he'll be reported back to Red Skull 
But Sam realised this was a no-go. It's a bad idea. He stopped all them ties. Got rid of the ties and just stuck with Captain America as a true good guy. So let's see how fucking awesome is this as a slight backstory. Instead of what we're getting at the minute. It's much more in-depth and complex and there's so much more going on. We might get a backstory at some point. Yeah, but I don't think they're going to go this route. Well, why? Well, Red Skull, as far as we're away, is gone. Yeah, because it's backstory, then we can come back down. Yeah, but the, when the Red Skull was actually kicking about him back in the 40s and Sam wasn't born yet. <laughs> uh, right, and amongst other things that the show doesn't really show you, or the films, he does actually have powers. In the comics, he has a bit more strength. Do you know what his other power is? Fly. Wow, this is a suit and shenanigans. Uh, he actually does have the power to speak to... Fish. Why the fuck would he speak to fish? <laughs> and the falcon, I saw through the skies. Oh my god, there's a mackerel birds. down there. Birds, yes. And he actually befriended a bird from Rio. I can't remember what kind of bird it was. I remember there was a, there was a thingy. The reason why I bring it up is the fact is, yeah, the, the fact is that he has the ability to speak to birds. It's a true power. He got really close to this bird, and it was borderline Weakness. sexual... Yeah, he, he they, they, it wasn't like, ah, uh, well, bro, you know, I, like, I love my dog. But he was just kind of like, ah, I love my bird. I really, I really love my, oh, my fucking bird. And it obviously is also the inspiration that would went on to be Red Wing that we know now. In fact, there's a picture of the actual Red Wing. On, I think it might be downstairs, the picture, but how weird is that? I'm actually, I'm spending the whole time talking to you. We should be talking to you. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful fact. Not to be confused here, right? But he was the first ever really, truly established African-American superhero. I know you're going to say, but damn, Black Panther. Black Panther was the first ever full, just African-born superhero. He was the first African-American superhero in all comic books. It's cool. I know you're racist, but I like that. I think racist? that's... Let's just put that up there. <laughs> I'm not racist. You're not really... <laughs> Uh, <laughs> visual <thing. laughs> there we go, that was your 5 Fast Facts on the Friday visuals. If you didn't enjoy Hubuski, Hubuski, Shanuski, let me know in the comments below. Anyway, more 5 Fast Facts on the Friday Uh B's gonna redo her hair purple. Chris is gonna measure the circumference of, of his heat. And I'm gonna make some oh, mac and cheese. I, <laughs> I don't know, I just like it. Okay, imagine if I needed a football and you were dead. I could dig you up hey, and use your head. Hey, football head! That's what you do. No. He's, yeah, he's on about. Football. I know. Whereas you're like <laughs> football. That was. Hey, to be fair, I do have a fairly round face. Same. Yeah, proper round face. I reckon mine would be. Yeah. You haven't really got a round face. Your squares off a fair bit. To be fair, you've got the same jawline nearly as the new cat. New cat. <laughs> the new cat. I should get him. The new cat. Oh, you Here's, that was the longest ever ever FF visuals. Usually I try to keep these videos maximum three minutes, but this uh, yeah, a little bit, yeah. But then I look at B and she's just like, because she's moving bridges and houses and that. And um, I've done moving houses. I've done that. I need to move shops now, but I'm on the bug hunt. She's good at moving places and moving in places. She moved in here and I didn't realise. It's just like... I keep on keeping up. <laughs>